Oh, goodness. The next game, apparently, is uh, one word at a time story, which, again, involves Daryl. It seems to be a very Daryl evening. And Daryl and myself. Daryl and Legend. Daryl and Write that in. Oh, oh it is. It's Daryl Hop Legend. As it goes to the regular... One of the middle Daryl. Idiot Daryl from the first scene. Oh, yeah. Okay. No, no. I thought I would have choose my word from the age of <laughs> So, uh, what we need here is, they're going to tell us a story. It's going to be a really cool story, but the catch is they can only tell us... Nice. One word at a time. <laughs> so what I, would like from, what I would like from the audience is the title of the story that they're about to tell us. Tits. <laughs> no tits. 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 No, no tits. Sandy Tomorrow tits. Sandy tits. tits. The pink chair is mine. Sarah. Woe be gone, empty <laughs> cookie jar. Woe be gone, empty cookie jar. Well, I can't suggest it. <laughs> empty Woe cookie gone, jar. Empty jar. This basketball. isn't my sand castle. This isn't my uh, sand castle. Go. <laughs> <laughs> Waking up one morning, young me <laughs> leapt upon my horse and galloped forward. I brought with me a page from London, which was written in Hebrew. <laughs> so I could not read it. <laughs> Damn! I thought and cursed. <laughs> God. <laughs> Dictionaries. <laughs> Why? Must I never learn Hebrew with which to read this page? Which I might read later if it were important. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, I galloped more until I reached a beach. <laughs> Crumpling the page into ashes. <laughs> I left it under a rock that might not be part of this story. <laughs> and horse, I said, get over into the ocean. So I can not get you any more wet if we cry. <laughs> Leaping back onto my steed, I swam across the English Channel and landed upon Spain. You can't know, it's a little anyway. You went south. Bonjour! I said in Spanish. I was really ready for Hebrew. K. S. S. Bueno. Kanichiwa! <laughs> Los Pablo Fritanas. <laughs> and the Spanish native replied by flipping me the bird. <laughs> <laughs> I offered my new horse <laughs> to the Spanish native, and he accepted my steed in exchange for his <laughs> wife. <laughs> oh ho, sailor. <laughs> she whispered in Hebrew. <laughs> and jumped onto the Rock that <laughs> held my page of ashes, which weren't not 
going into this story. But, nevertheless, there was something I knew about that wife. She was Hebrew and portly and Randy. <laughs> the moral of the story is if you encounter a Spanish native, speak Hebrew. <laughs>